So hello people, how you going? This is Glenn from Goomadi Coins and Banknotes. And who out of you have actually seen this coin? Or actually have got this coin? This is an Australian 50 cent coin, as you can see it's Australia. 1788 to 1988. So this coin represents when the uh, first fleet from the United Kingdom first arrived in Australia, arrived in Bot Botany Bay in 1788, and it carried a boatload of uh, convicts, and convicts are just uh, criminals, or people who've committed a crime, or probably a uh, political prisoners that have been transported to Australia because well England at the time was uh, locking up a lot of people just for a small amount of things and one of the punishments was transportation to another colony so as you can see this coin is actually in pretty good condition it has some damage up here and around the sides, but some scratches, but mainly it's probably uh, extremely fine. That's my conditioning. Okay, so on this we have the a ship. I'm not too sure what ship it is. Maybe it's the Endeavour that Cook was on. I'm not too sure. Um, he has the Southern Cross, which is also on the Australian flag. It's also on the flag of Papua New Guinea, Samoa, uh, Brazil, New Zealand, and probably a few other countries. And here we have uh, a map of um, what Australia, or what they think Australia looked like at the time. It had New Holland because um, Dutch explorers are also scouting this area, and it's named after Holland. And Australia itself just means southern land in Latin. And up here we have uh, what is currently Indonesia. This, so this will be the island of New Guinea. And up here we have a compass with uh, look like a fleur up the top and two uh, musket type guns. So then definitely different than modern guns. And this coin had a mintage of nine million, but because uh, at the time it was issued in between the period of 1985 and 1993, only 15.7 million coins actually of this denomination were issued in the circulation. And because it's a commemorative one, with a pretty good design as you can see, this coin probably would have been taken out of circulation by coin collectors and people thinking that at a future date it will be worth a lot of money. So here is the obverse, so the obverse of Australian coins of Queen Elizabeth II. And this was the Queen's head that was used between 1985 and 1998. Currently, this coin is uh, probably a little bit hard to get in circulation. Maybe you can get it like 1 in 200 coins, something like that. But most of the coins I've got in circulation have been in this good condition. And I just ask you for minted to 9 million uh, do you think it's worth collecting just one coin or more than one so yeah if you are planning on visiting Australia or if you are in Australia I recommend you just collect any of these coins that you have in change and either you could um, give it to other people to encourage coin collection or you could sell them yourself anyway if you like this coin please just give this video a thumbs up and if you're interested in getting one of these coins and you're not in Australia I'll leave a link down below to uh, eBay you could um, 
search for and tr probably try and get the cheapest deal possible. So thank you very much and have an awesome coin collecting day.